hey everybody, it's Alex again, um, this time with a uh, deck update. Um, so I've been doing some playtesting uh, with the deck that I showed off before. Um, this is my nimble coelacanth thing running uh, the e-dragon so I can drop the nimble angler. Um, and I've made a couple changes, uh, yeah, uh, the, some pretty obvious, I put in a foolish burial, uh, I, I realized, and other than that, I realized that my deck was just too geared towards the E-Dragon matchup with the obelisks in deck, and it was inconsistent. Um, at the same time, there are things that I wish I had more of in this deck. Like, I, I wish I could fit a second Valor in and two more Maxi, because that card's really good right now. Um, just against a bunch of different decks. Uh, yeah. Um... I opted to put Light and Darkness in, uh, it, it was just a good card. Other than that, the deck remains pretty much the same. Some things I've been thinking about, oh, and uh, by the way, uh, fully fledged uh, side deck now. Uh, I might replace something in here, like maybe... Uh, one of the light and darknesses, because I can't see myself running more, with Obelisk, just for the matchup with E-Dragons, which I already feel like I have a pretty good chance at beating. Um, yeah. The Spell Cancelers are in here for the Spellbook matchup. Uh, because in game two, they normally side out their back row hate. Uh, I don't know. It, sometimes. It depends if I get this game one or not, the Lemuria. The more I play with Exodios, the more I want to put it to three. And the less I can find room. Uh, some interesting cards of note from the extra deck though um, the vanities fiends they get sided in a lot uh, against windups against uh, insectors although it's not as good in, uh, against insectors and I normally just side in another one of these and like one of these it's just nice to have the board presence because yeah um, against E-Dragons, and, uh, yeah. I guess that's enough to be relevant. Um, Coelacanth still at three would not change it. The only consideration I would have for this is if I was going to pull it for a, uh, What's that guy called? Gold Sarcophagus. Uh, because that instantly searches me one of these, which searches me one of these. Or I can search out this, depending on how well the game's going. But, yeah. I almost wish I had more targets for the fish because I run out really quick <laughs> yeah um so I'll, I'll just run through the monster lineup and then oh yeah yeah the extra deck the extra deck that's another thing that got changed and I'll go over that real quick before I uh, finish off with the deck list. Um, I added in the third Gachi Gachi because I, I thought, well, what if I don't get Lemuria? 
What if what if I'm sitting on two gachi gachi to protect me from just a massive field? And I was like, well, why not just put in three just in case, you know? Um, dark mist still fine. Um, all of these are still the same. That's fine. That's fine. I, I want to put in a second one of these, but I don't really have the room. Uh, just like... I don't have the budget for uh, Draco Sack, which might be something that I didn't touch on in the last video. I don't have the budget for Big Eye either, but, you know... I guess I'll run it, because it's dueling network. Um... I just don't like to test with cards that I can't get, because all of these cards are pretty dang cheap, uh, minus the Constellar guy, but I've got the rest of the cards, I think. Uh, anything expensive here? Just checking for you guys, because this deck is pretty dang budget. Yeah, other than other than Big Eye, this deck is budget. Like you could probably pick up the extra deck for like 50 bucks if you trade smart. Um yeah, other than that, I don't think I made many changes to the deck. All right, so I'm just going to run through the deck list. Uh I mentioned all the changes in the extra deck. Um so yeah, leave comments uh, below telling me if you like the new build. Uh, and shout outs to my buddy Jesse at uh, in the uh, in THA sack um, for suggesting that I update my deck list. Uh, two light and darkness dragon. 3 Coelacanth, 3 Nimble Angler, uh, 2 Nimble Manta, uh, 3 Nimble Sunfish, 3 Tidal Dragon of Waterfalls, uh, 3 Swap Frog, 3 Dupe Frog, th 2 Ronin, uh, 1 Effect Feeler, 1 Max C, uh, 2 Exodios, 3 Lemuria, 2 Terraforming, 1 Foolish, 1 Pot of Avarice, 1 Monster Reborn, 1 Dark Hole, 1 Heavy Storm, 1 MST. Um, and the extra deck, because it's relevant now, uh, seeing as I have a fully fledged one, Light and Darkness Dragon, 2 Effect Feeler, uh, 2 Max C, 2 Vanity's Fiend, 2 Mystical Space Typhoon, uh, three spell canceller and one royal decree. All right. Uh, thanks so much for watching this, guys. Um, catch you all later. Uh, yeah, and thanks for all the views. Just hit hit eight thousand. Woohoo. Um, yeah. I'll probably put up a second deck profile right after this. So, if you guys like new content, just, you know, 